Hello everybody and welcome back to a brand new episode of Top Drives. Now in today's episode we are going to be doing the KTM Expo GTX tune-up. I haven't started Top Drives records in the background because I have a feeling we are gonna be just fine without it. Um, however, how true that feeling will ring is uh, a different story. We shall see. Uh, but I am excited for today's episode because obviously um, We get a carbon fiber in the end of it and I am always excited when there are Nice packs involved let me tell you um, Now as always down below in the comment section if you would be so kind as to let me know how you did in this particular event, did you do as well as me? Did you do better? Did you do worse? So on so forth, yada yada. It's always interesting to see how you guys did in correlation to me. Um, and I'm al always very interested in seeing this uh, whenever there is a challenge. Unlucky for the Porsche. Unlucky. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I'm super excited for the uh, ceramic pack and then the carbon fiber pack that will occur in today's video um, And I hope some good cars will come out of those uh, for sure We'll see though. We'll see Okay I think as usual the uh, tune-up will be structured so it's quite easy to get at least the ceramic pack and then it gets a little bit harder for the last push to the carbon fiber that's at least usually how I feel like they align these um, so that's what I'm kind of thinking is going to occur here um, we'll see whether I am right or wrong in that momentarily obviously as we will go through these rounds here pretty quickly um, and see what's up, basically. Um, this should also be just fine and dandy, which is nice. Uh, it looks like we aren't running into any major problems in the start of the challenge, which is always a brilliant sign, right? Uh, but that being said, we haven't really had to use more than one Enter the Black Forest car, which I think is kind of crazy. Um, Considering we are five rounds in now, I would have expected that I needed to use uh, some other cars by now, but no. Um, that's fine by me though, if they want to make it super, super easy for us. Uh, that's uh, totally fine. And that's the first five rounds, guys. Um, now we need two, now we need two. So they are actually doing... At least a little something to make it a little bit more difficult here. Um. So far so good though, so far so good for me at least. You just need to have some better uh, low RQ cars to get to the uh, aluminum pack, it would seem. Um, it's not going to be too difficult for any of you, I don't think, uh, to get at least to where I am right now. But we'll see how the challenge progresses after this aluminum. Obviously, there are some nice cars in the rare and ultra rare category for Enter the Black Forest, so maybe we can pick up one of those. Yeah, like that one, the Lotus, for instance. Very, very good car. Um, you know? Round number nine, I think this is. Yeah, I was afraid about that one. Okay. Well, we have to exchange it. 
But that should be fine. Let's just get something else than this. A small bit annoying though, I'm not gonna lie, but uh, we should be fine going through it with this hand right here, which we are very very nice at least. Round number 9 coming up here, and we have a full rain and uh, a little bit hierarchy round here. So let's see if we can tackle that one, it's very twisty as well, so we definitely need like a full rain get up here. Um, Let's do something like this, and we should be good, right? So boom, boom, um, boom, 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 and we should be good, I think. That's good. That's good. I don't think we need really to look much more than that. Very nice. And we move on to round number 10. Uh, and again, we have sort of a rainy time here except for one which is interesting so boom boom uh, boom 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 let's see this should be all good i do believe i want to see the second race though just in case we do lose this one but i don't think so no 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 chance very good very good uh, round number 11, now we need to buy tickets, which is fine, and now we need three Enter the Black Forest cars. Let's have a look at what's up. It's a on-road with some um, fields, which is interesting. So let's put in these two and then this one for the on-road, and then on-road and on-road, on-road, mm. on-road, I guess. Um, hairpin, fast circuit, drag, field, cross country. Should be good, right? That's fine. Yeah, I don't think we need to watch so much more of this. Uh, almost at ceramic round uh, now, which is nice. No, we lose one. Okay. I hoped I wouldn't have to, you know, exchange stuff, but apparently I do. There we go. Should be good, right? Hopefully. Let's watch it just in case. Imagine it was this we lost, but I don't think so. No. Okay, very nice. Moving on. Ceramic pack round. Of course, a ceramic pack is quite interesting. There can be quite a few different options of cars in there. Uh, some very, very good as well. So hopefully we can get something nice today. We shall see though. We shall see. Ceramic pack round, so obviously we are watching it. Okay, so far so good. This one should be a breeze as well, very nice. That is totally fine as well, very nice. No, bro. Seriously? <laughs> oh, my lord. Okay, well, this can just be any car. So let's just put in something very quick and we'll be just out of here. Um, there we go. This time I'm not gonna watch the entire round through again because we know we win. So 
skip it. I didn't press skip. Nice. There we go. Okay, ceramic pack. Give me the car on the pack. That would be absolutely amazing if I could get that one. Um. Ooh, and... Alright, I'll take the two super rares. I mean, fused food is always nice. Doesn't really matter. Uh, it's always going to be useful in some way, shape, or form. Okay, so we have two rain. Two drag. Okay. Mm. Two rain, two drag. Let's have this one come in. This one come in, and then, like, I don't know. Two rain, I forgot about two rain. Yeah, let's actually uh, honor that and uh, put in a rainy car of some sort. Hmm, we'll see about that. Okay. Not so easy round, let's see if we do it. Uh, that is a win to start us off at least. This should be just totally fine. 79 points even. And this right here should be fine as well. Eighty-six to seventy-five handling is what I'm coping for, and it is indeed going to be a win. Very nice, and that's a win. Very good. Very very good. All right, round number fifteen coming up here. Um, twisty road, fast circuit. Ah, stall on test. Well. Are we fine? Are we fine with this? That's good. That's good. This should be fine, right? 93. Yeah, yeah. It is. And that's good. And that's good. Okay, we are fine with just the same hand. Very nice. Okay, moving on. Round number 16. And now we need four of the Enter the Black Forest cars. And let's have a look at what's up. So we have one twisty circuit, which this should be fine for. So if we do twisty G-Force... One mile. Fast, fast. Right? Should be good. I think so. Um. That's very nice. That's very, very nice. Okay, moving on. Round number 17. Okay. Win, win. Okay, we need... Uh, this to be exchanged now. Uh, I will put in. Huh. Yeah, maybe this guy. Why not? Okay. Um. Where can this win though? It can't really. So we're gonna have to exchange him too for something better. Let's have him go in. And then something like this. Sorry if you can hear the rain in the background, guys. It is literally pouring down uh, today. It's been a very, very rainy day. How are things wherever you are in the world? Are you also experiencing some rainy climates right now? Uh, or is it rather sunny? Um, it's always interesting to see. I know I have a lot of people who live in places where it's very much mostly sunny. Um, so I hope you're having a nice time with your son, and I wish you could share some. Um, I'm having a nice time with this challenge though, if we are gonna segue right back into it here. We are actually getting very close to the end here. Round number 19 coming up, and it's full rain, which is quite interesting. Uh, what can we do about full rain right now? We have this standard tire, this standard tire, this four-wheel drive. 
uh, and this standard tire. I mean, we have a really good hand for something like that because I like prioritizing actually maxing out a variety hand and uh, in a variety hand you gotta have some standard tire stuff so therefore I'm actually quite well geared for standard tire stuff no matter what the tag or whatever and that is unfortunate though that we would lose that I think we need to put this somewhere else uh, and then we'll put one of these guys here instead uh, and all should be well I think so that seems a little better um, and that is indeed a pass, moving into round 20. And here we have a full drag track set actually, which is quite intriguing. Uh, what do we have that is quick? I mean, this is quick. This is kind of quick, I do believe. Um, this might be sort of quick. And then, of course, we gotta get a, a proper actual drag car. I mean, this is fine, but we'll get a proper drag car, right, surely. Let's get like this in maybe. Let's get this in. Okay, so let's figure this one out. I reckon that should be totally fine. That is fine as well. Um, but I think we wanna put that versus the legendary there. So let's do that. And then I'm gonna put them like this. And I think that's best. Let's have a look. So first of all, Oh my, okay, never mind. That's 123 points there for that one. 50 points there. Oh, that's actually a loss. Okay, interesting. I do have that car too. Um. That is totally fine. I think, honestly, we need some swapperoos here. Um, so this one is just clearly a better choice than this one with lower RQ as well. So that's gonna be swapped. Uh, I do believe this one should go in instead of this then. So then this should be a better, better balanced hand, right? So now we're gonna swap some things around. I want to try this one here. Hopefully it makes it all the way. I will try this one here to see if that would work. I will try this one here, I think. And then this here and this here. Would that work? Maybe. That is fine, which is nice. And this is fine, we know this. This is a lot of points as well. And let's try this, which is not fine. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try that on the one mile then. That is fine, which is cool. And this is also fine. Yeah, okay. So what I am going to do is I am going to actually just swap places with this going here and this going here. And we'll see how that fares. We do have a higher top speed than the competitor, so perhaps that will actually make it work here? We shall see. It does, very nice. Okay, so then we should be all good here. Moving on, round number 21, we're moving into the final five rounds here. And now we need a full Enter the Black Forest hand, which is quite intriguing. Let's do something like... Man, I don't really have many maxed out cars for this tag, do I? Holy moly. Let's do this to just test the waters here. This should be fine there. Uh, this is fine there, right? But mm, This is also fine there, so let's put that one there. Let's put this one here. Let's have that one go there and this one go there. And let's see if that works. Um... Yes, very nice. That's good to know. And let's see this. Yes, very good. 
that is indeed gonna work as well. Very nice. And this should be fine. So it is. Very, very nice. Okay, so, so far so good here. Uh, round number 22. Again, I wonder if that would work there, honestly. Uh, for the rest of these though, now this is starting to look... Hmm. Okay, so this guy is gonna get replaced by something with more handling. So this can beat here. Okay, so we have that one beaten. We have this one beaten, I'm hoping. Uh, we have this one beaten, perhaps. And we have this one beaten. So then, talk your loop. We do have a maxed out standard tires car for that. So let's hope that works. I'm actually also gonna upgrade this to one star. To hopefully help it a little bit on the drag here. And then, hopefully this could work like this. We shall see, we shall see. So we start off with the G-Force test, which is a success, very nice. And then we have this one. Which we indeed win by quite a bit, 130 points acquired there. And then we have this, which we just have a more upgraded version of his, so that's fine. And then we have this, which is to 60s, I think we win, and we do. And then finally, we have this, which should be fine, I think. Yep, it barely is. Very nice, okay. So, we move on to round number 23 here, and we have even more points now. Uh, let's figure this one out real quick. Okay. So, with these extra points... We can buff up our hand quite a bit. What if we tried something like this, right? Okay, well, this has no place anymore. Um, so what if we put in this instead, something like that? So what my thing, what what my thinking would be here is that this would go here. That's perfect matchup. This would go here. This could go here, here, and here. Would that work? I feel like that's a good one. That's a tie, okay. Hmm. Is this a win? It is, very nice, okay. And that is going to be a win. And that is going to be a win. And that is going to be a win, but yeah. So, the tie, we're gonna have to do something about. And I think what we could potentially do is if we were to put this one instead like what if we put this here and this here right you wouldn't this just fix it immediately i think so that's fine and i think this other one should be fine as well right yeah yeah yep so there we go we fixed it no problem very very nice so that was round number 23 round number 24 coming up And now we have points. Now we really have points. Okay. Hmm. This one should get upgraded to one star. I'm doing that now. Okay. So let's have this one come in instead of like this. Because we have so many points now. Uh, do we have any other like upgrades we could potentially do? I mean, we could do this, right? Yeah. Okay. So let's figure this one out now. Does this still have a place? I think so. Like something like this. And then for these others, I think we should put this one here. This here. No, we should put this one here. This one here. This one here. Here and here. This should be good. That is indeed fine. That is perfectly good as well. That's good. Very nice. I was a little bit worried about that one. And this should be good. 95. Yeah. And the final race is indeed a win. Very nice. 
Okay, and we move on to the final round, carbon fiber pack round, and we have a full rain, full rain moment. Okay, so this one comes in, this one comes in, this one comes in. And let's figure it out. Okay, when well, this one definitely goes out. Um, okay, so... Um, hmm. This one kind of needs to go out as well. Okay, this one should be able to win there. Um, I'm hoping this will do here. And then this here. This here and this here. Should this be fine? I think so. First race is a win, 81 points. Second race is a win as well, 50 points. And then we have the third one, 87 to 81, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we have this, which I think we should win with our extra handling, and we do. And finally, we have this one. And here we have four wheel drive standard tires, yeah, yeah, yeah. Boom. Perfect! Carbon Fiber Pack coming up. Enter the Black Forest. Carbon Fiber Pack. We move with the Holden Epic immediately. One of the rares I do not have. Very, very nice to get a uh, wishlisted car. The Nissan Almera GTI. And the Abarf Punto Evo SSS. So nothing special for the first three. We have the Porsche Boxster Concept and... Okay, nothing special there. I already had those cars, unfortunately. But there you go. That was the KTM Expo GTX tune-up. How did you do in this challenge? Did you do as well as me? Or did you struggle in this one? Please let me know down below in the comment section. As always, it's always interesting to read how you guys did... Um, compared to me if you do want to see what i'm currently maxing out i have an instagram page where i post every single max that i do and if you do want to join one of the biggest top drives discord communities check out my discord server it's called the top drives hideout we have over 2,000 members already but we could always use another one that is linked down below in the description both of those are obviously completely free to check out and if you do want to support me further i have both a patreon and a youtube membership and you can also support me by just subscribing to the channel we're on that road to 11,000 subscribers and we are getting ever so closer every each and every passing day so thank you so much for watching until the very next time guys stay safe have a good one take care of one another and goodbye guys